Ready? Hi, I'm John Perry, Technical Project Manager with IPC, here with IPC's Tech Question of the Week. Uh, the question for this week relates to land patterns, specifically for through-hole technology. Many people in our industry are aware of what standards we have for surface mount land pattern design, starting with IPC SM782 way back in 1987 and continuing on currently with IPC 7351. But the question we often get is, what does IPC have with regards to land patterns for through-hole technology? And while we don't specifically have a standard for through-hole land patterns like we do for surface mount, what we do have is some guidance for the designer in our IPC 2222, which is our sectional design standard for rigid printed boards. And in section 922 of IPC 2222, we talk about the relationship of the lead diameter to the hole diameter. And what I mean by that is information on the uh, minimum lead size to a maximum hole size, and conversely, a maximum lead size to a minimum hole size. Uh, this coupled with the tolerance information we give on a uh, plated through hole diameter tolerance, as well as the requirements for internal and annular ring for the board designer, uh, we provide information that the designer can now uh, build an optimum through hole land pattern. Uh, what I would like to say though is uh, with all that being said in, our, in, in the immediate future we are working on an IPC 7251 which will complement the existing 7351 for surface mount land pattern design and 7251 will address specific land patterns for through hole technology including radial and axial leaded through hole parts and it's our hope that we'll have this document completed by the end of 2009. Thanks.